All right, we just got the uh, new Alien B B400s in uh, the Martian pink, so we'll take a look at these and see how these look. Um, and I'm assuming these are the light stands that go with them. A uh, little smaller boxes than I expected uh, for the amount of stuff that we ordered. Um, this is supposed to be a full kit, so get into it and see what's inside. All right, so we open these up and we've got our operations manual. Uh, some clips for gels, I believe, and uh, all that information. Let's see here. If we can get into this. This might be hard to do with one hand. But got the dish on there, and then. The Flash unit itself underneath. There's one of the power cords. Uh, let's see here. I think this is a sink cord. Yeah, there's a sink cord in there. And I'm gonna take this out with both hands. Okay, so once you get that out, um, you know, it's wrapped up pretty well in this uh, kind of mosquito netting looking stuff in here. And from what I can tell, this is very very pink so should look kind of cool I hope and uh, you know it, it came packed really well let's see if I can get into here get everything unwrapped alright so here it is uh, unwrapped and out of the package it comes with this uh, handy dandy little oh that's upside down um, protector to protect the flash tube while it's uh, in shipping so that's pretty nice and then here's a look at the back of this unit. It's uh, fully adjustable from full power down to 132nd. Uh, you got your sink input, uh, your slave, modeling light, all the good stuff. And uh, here's the look at the other side there. And a uh, pretty compact unit, maybe weighs about, no, oh, maybe five, six pounds, so feels pretty good in the hand pretty lightweight so get the uh, rest of them out and put them up and see what they look like okay so that tube must have been filled with like a mile of this stuff but uh, once you get inside um, that's where um, and the dog just stole it from me um, once you get inside there's the umbrellas the stand and uh, these nifty little carrying cases I was kinda wondering where these were I guess they were in that big box as part of the kit so now I'm gonna start assembling. They uh, look pretty good and uh, they're pretty much all assembled and then we've got our umbrellas over here and then they also come with just a little 150 watt modeling bulb so I'll have to put those in and then I'll uh, take them downstairs and set them up or set them up wherever I'm gonna use them and we'll test them out. But. Uh, these actually uh, look pretty good and uh, I think I'm pretty happy with these. This is my first uh, light kit so um, you know I didn't go all out or anything. I figure you know 400, 400 watts each head is probably uh, more than enough for what I'm going to be using them for and uh, I'm pretty excited you know I've used uh, you know the, what the newspaper used to have I used their uh, their light kit before and it was a set of white lightning I'm not even sure it's been so many years but uh, they were a set of white lightnings so um, I saw that Paul C. Buff makes the uh, the white lightnings and makes the alien bees as kind of more of a budget conscious model so uh, I figured what the heck we'll try the uh, the B400s and see and hopefully we'll you know add a third light to this kit here as soon as I've decided if, if these are what I really want to keep going with, uh, if these work out well for me. So, I'll check back in a little bit.